so that on Monday we, we, we get moving. By Monday, as agreed, we will have the secretariats that will be supported by Parliament uh, for Secretary of Services. We also have technical committees backing up each of our teams. We've agreed to set up, um, um, there will be two technical teams on both sides with a rapporteur on both sides. And we have agreed that um, uh, the speakers of parliament will provide the answered reporters. We, we felt that is very important because subsequently we expect there will be documents generated and they will require, they will require presentation perhaps uh, on the floor of both houses. We have indicated also that we will be engaging on the basis of mutual respect, all in the interest of our nation and not uh, in any private interest or any personal interest. But everything that we shall engage on will be for the benefit of the country and the people of this great country. We are generally in agreement with uh, the agenda items, but we have to agree on the, how we frame the agenda. Uh, because the two sides have the different agenda items. We will take this process very, very seriously. And our president has directed that we do so. And that we'll continue to consult both within here and outside in order that we can come up with long-lasting solutions. Mimi Naona, it's a, it's a contradiction of facts that we are here in Kenyaga to celebrate one year since our president got elected. Na kuna watu pia Nairobi, wanaogea maneno pia ya uchaguzi siku ya leo. Na diyo maana mimi ni kiagalia. Ata hiyo mazugumuzo hiko Nairobi. Mimi naona tuachane nayo, tuyaderea na kazi. Na hawa watu sulitururu wa shinda mapema? So nikuwa wanazunguka hapa na kitenda wili, sijui na nini, na nini, tuka wanyorosha, waende nyumbani. Ama na magani? Na wakitaka si wangoje 2027? Ndiyo tuta wawonyesha kivumbi marahi. Sijui kama hata watapata hati, watapata hata agent ya kusimamia mambo yao. Na mimi rais amenipatia kazi ya kutosha. Unajua yeye alikuwa mekatazo kufanya kazi. Sasa yeye amenipatia kazi saa higina na ninalemewa. Mutaendelea kuniombea? Eh? Ana niambia mara, enda pabana na kahawa. Ana toa kwa kahawa, enda kwa majani chai. Oh, enda pabana na pombe. Oh, hii msea kitenda wili ya nalete shida, ona vile watafanya, awache sisi kusumbua. Sasa kazi mimi ni kwa kazi ya kutosha. Jambo la kwanza, mambo ya fujo, ya vita, na vurugu, ya maandamano ya fujo, hakuna Kenya tena. Jambo la pili, na muhimu zaidi, mambo ya nusu mkate, na handshake, na cooperation, na kunusa nusa serikali, na kukaribia serikali, hakuna. Na tumeambia wale watu wa maandamano, kuweka sufuria kwa kichwa haita punguza karama ya unga. Kufanya maandamano kuharibu mali ya watu na kuharibu biashara ya watu haiwezi kupunguza gharama ya maisha. Wacheni upuzi. Wacheni ujinga. Tubadilishe nchi yetu. And I want to give you assurance. We are going to change Kenya together. Hii Kenya tutaibadilisha. The Uda regime has responded by going to Mount Kenya on a publicity stunt. Launching projects that have been built by the county governments. Uh, for example, the Narumoro Level 4 Hospital that was built by the county government of Nyeri. Also, uh, launching projects, some of which were completed more than two years ago uh, by the government of President Uhuru, including the Kenomaroa Road, which as you all know, uh, was practically complete by the time of the general election. Hakuna barabara ya uhuru hapa. Mm. Hakuna barabara ya ruto hapa. Ni barabara zimeje Bar kuona Barabara ni wananchi ya wananchi. Kwani barabara ya kiamabara uhuru wanaishi kiamabara wapi? Ama mimi naishi naishi kiamabara wapi? Zini wale watu wa kiamabara ndio wanataka barabara yao. Mm. Na ni wanalipa ushuru. So, hizi kazi zote hizi zimetengenezwa na pesa ya Kenya. Haven't you seen bodies about mid bodies put together then pictures are taken? drone all over in the social media and the information i have is they go to some of the mortuaries compromise the workers there people even who died of uh, some illness people who died maybe out of a, an accident or other causes they take photographs of such bodies and blame on police
And it is actually very disappointing to see a statement from Inspector General of Police, Mr. Kome, saying that we hired dead bodies <laughs> to accuse police of brutality. I don't know in which world he lives. Because the bodies we've been burying have bullet wounds. We'd want to pursue personal responsibility, particularly for um, the police commanders that we're able to establish. As professional officers, what they have done in the recent past is commendable. I commend all of them. I wish and the medros the particular majawa. Omefanya kazi nzuri. Meona kome ametajwa mara karibu 20 kwa hiyo barua. Sasa nashindwa nduguzanguni. Asine politician spending all the energy